So far, we've had three wonderful, fun-filled, exciting, informative um, summer camp with the children. And we have a lot of children. We have about 54 children in all. We have planned for quite uh, a, a fewer number, but then, you know, parents have shown up and they wanted to enlist their children, so we took them in. The camp has been in progress for several days, with each day having its own scheduled lessons. First day had been what we called conchatology, so we had everything about conch. And we painted some conch, and then we learned a lot of stories about conch. And then uh, we had a resource person come in, um, Rachel Harvey. She wrote a story on Lobster Lita and Conchacello, which tells about children doing their part in taking care of the environment, especially of the conch and the lobster, which is very precious to us. Other activities include fishing and learning about national parks. Today, the schedule focused on a session with the TCI firefighters, a journalism session with PTV, and police work with the TCI police commissioner. News 4 visited the camp today to ask the kids about their lessons. They show us the engine. The engine the works, works the holes. And the holes. So the holes spray really hard. Yeah? And before it came right through the hole, the hole is spraying me. <gasps> it did. You got wet? Yeah, like that they give like oh! Okay, the first day that um we painted um conch shells and then the second day we went fishing and then today we um the fireman came and told us that fire is not good when if you are um, in a place and there is fire and fire is on, you must stop, drop and roll. The camp is scheduled to end this weekend. Wrap-up day is on Saturday and we're inviting the parents to come and see what the children have done and the children will have some presentations for them also. However, before the camp is completed, there are a few more lessons for the kids to learn, including a crash course in etiquette. And on Friday, we'll, we'll go to beaches to do an etiquette 101, I, I called it, teach about um, fine dining, etiquette, social grace. So they will have a formal lunch right there, sponsored by Beaches, and I will ask them to dress in their formal wear, and um, people from the tourism school, from the Touch and Takers um, Professional Studies School, um, they will teach them how to act properly, uh, what to use, what um, utensils to use, which spoon goes first. So it, it, this will be a very informative day for them.